Muss is from Southern California. His wife he met in California. I believe she lived in California at the time. You know, he's got a family. So let me just ask you, if you had a family, where where would you rather raise your family? If And, and if you were from Southern California, Fayetteville, Arkansas, or Los Angeles. So that's the main issue here is like we can live in, hey, Hey, you guys want to live in L.A. or do you want to stay here in Fayetteville, Arkansas? And I I don't mean that disrespectfully to Fayetteville, Arkansas. I've been there. I enjoy it. It's just not L.A. Period. And it's not home, and so, right? Like that's where he and was. It's not, like, and it's not home. Mm-hmm. So I think what Musk probably understands accurately is that he can go to USC and it doesn't have the history of Arkansas. But if he has an NIL budget and just the re- natural recruiting base that is Los Angeles, I mean, they did just enroll Bronny James. So there's some cachet there. Um, not that he thinks he, can, he, can, he, he thinks he can get that thing going and, um, and then have a nationally relevant basketball program while living in Los Angeles as opposed to a nationally relevant basketball program while living in Arkansas. That's, that's the long and short of it. So you think this is less about coaching and like his actual oh, job I, and more I, about life? I think he I think he was ready to go. I think there was probably this is and I say this as somebody who likes Muss and have never had any friction with him whatsoever. Like I've never had an uncomfortable conversation with him. I've never seen him be uh in a way that I would find not ideal. Mm-hmm. But he the reputation is that he is hard to work for. He is hard he can be he can grind on you and these relationships that he creates in an employment setting can get really worn down fairly quickly. Like he's an intense guy. And so I, I when I say living in LA is the biggest part of it, I, I, I should be clear, it's not the only part of it. There's, a, there's other factors, obviously, there always is. Um, and I think just that he was ready to go and had maybe, I don't know that he and his athletic director had the best relationship at this point in time. So I think he was just ready to go. And I think he would have taken the Louisville job if he could have got that, or maybe even the Washington job if he could have gotten that. But but ultimately, I th- I think living in a different place with your family that was very high on the list of of things that was attractive to him. The Gary Parish Show live weekdays at 10 a.m.